Good evening. I come to you tonight from the graves of my ancestors. It's Veterans Day. It seemed appropriate, seeing as how almost every one of my ancestors is a veteran. This is my grandparents' grave right here behind me. Grand Grandpa Paul Sr. Served in World War II. Saw the whole thing. Never talked about it at all until about two months before he really got, you know, pretty bad with the cancer. And then he told me and my dad everything. He never really cared much for Veterans Day. <laughs> he really kind of saw enough of it when he was there. Um, I'm not really too hot on it either. Not because I think it's like stupid or anything. I just... I realize what Veterans Day is really all about. It's not about parades. It's not about all that stuff. Maybe some of these people can tell me what Veterans Day is about. Anybody? Anyone can tell me what Veterans Day is about? Anyone? That's alright. You just chill out. We're honoring people not because of the uniform they wore, the flag that they carried. We're honoring people that stood up for what they believed in, for what was right. And when it gets right down to it, do you really look at the uniform they had on or what country they're from or anything like that? You know, you're just really kind of glad they came back alive. Or maybe they didn't come back alive. You miss them very much. Maybe they're still over there. The point is, you're honoring somebody who has the balls, sorry, the courage <laughs> to stand up for what something that they feel is right and important. And they've risked their lives to do it. I just, uh, you know, the whole thing is Veterans Day, it's not really every holiday is just really about, it's not what it actually is. That stuff's all just like kind of a scam. When you get down to the core of it, it's kind of just like a chance. It's an excuse. It's an opportunity to tell someone how much you care. So, you know, it's Veterans Day. So I'm coming out here, it's freezing cold, it's nighttime, I'm not even allowed to be here, I'm breaking the law by being in this cemetery after dark. Cop station's right over there, if they see me I'll probably be in big trouble, but I don't care. I'm doing all this, you know, because I believe it's right that I show my respect on Veterans Day. So, I don't know, I guess they call that the American spirit or whatever, just doing what you gotta do. Uh, so, yeah, I really don't have time to go through the whole list of all the veterans I know in my family and friends and everything else. It's not really an HBO special. I'm not going to stand here reading a sheet. But believe me, there's a lot of them. And I do think about them a lot. And I do come here and put flowers on this grave. I do come here and just sit here sometimes. Mostly just because I miss my grandparents and my family. It's not really have much to do with the whole veteran thing, but I do take that into account. When I come here to put the flags on their graves, it does matter to me. It's a part of their life. It's something they did.
and you know I think they're really cool so you know my grandpa's right here <laughs> next to his wife Helena my grandma I'm actually leaning on their infant son who passed when he was very young his name's Butch um, Richard is right beside me Yeah, they're all, it's, I got family all around me here. It's just, I look around and I think of everybody. You can't see it. There's flags everywhere. Uh, the thing is, I just recently learned my dad is also soon going to be right here. I don't really know how else to say it. So, there it is. Usually, every Veterans Day, me and him come out here and uh, pour out some whiskey for all the veterans and everybody else, really, on the ground as a salute, a sign of respect. It's actually an ancient European custom. A lot of people think it's a hip-hop gangster thing. Pour one out for my homies. No, it goes way, way back. Way back. It's called libation. Look it up. Google it. <laughs> so, I'm just going to do that right now. Sign of respect for everyone. I got you. Cheers. Stuff. Not a big drinker. Only on special occasions like this when it's meaningful. It's a beautiful moonlit night. You really can't ask for a better night to be in a graveyard. Well, I don't really have anything else to say, and I'm pretty emotionally upset right now. So, to all the veterans out there, Living, dead, and future veterans everywhere. I, myself, and we all salute you. Happy Veterans Day, and good night. <laughs>